Yes, but Ed, I suppose. Yes, I just hope. Uh, yes, it's not uh, always necessary to uh, hurt people. Sometimes uh, I suppose it can't be helped, but uh, it can happen that sometimes what somebody has told you you ought to do is not something you have to do anyway. I don't know specifically the exact details, but I'm thinking in terms of uh, my wife's grandmother was 88 years old and uh, due to die any day when my wife accepted Islam. Now, she covered herself. Her, her grandmother is dying out of her mind nearly anyway. She thought if she sees me dressed like this, she's going to be shocked. So when she went in to visit her grandmother before she went in the room, she took this thing off her head. So her mother would say, what happened to you, you see? Because who says she has to go and upset her grandmother the day before she dies when she's half out of her mind anyway with something that's going to frighten her better she might say a nice thing to her grandmother say what you know what are you thinking about now set her mind at ease in some way um, although there are some I, I knew a young man in Toronto who was his parents literally would kill him if they knew he was a Muslim and yet the Muslim students around there were saying you've got to go to your parents and tell them that you're a Muslim he doesn't even live with them they live a long ways away so you've got to go there today and tell them this what for so they can kill him I guess you know that that is uh, I'm sure that's an extreme case but that's how you might have been put in that position some people will insist on something they have no right to insist on and I don't know the details there but uh, so if you're looking for advice ask a lot of people <laughs> don't take the first piece of advice somebody tells you somebody may insist on something that and they don't know the, the full story you see? well as I say I don't know all the details that requires some some discussion yeah oh, well what I'm getting at is for example if you're visiting with your well of course you might be surprised too uh, I'd only recommend I know a young American who uh, who's uh, thought his uh, Oh, oh, all right. Yeah. Yes. Well, anyway, as I say, I, you might be surprised, but I think if you think you know the mind of somebody, uh, I knew a, a young man who's uh, uh, was talking about Islam to his sister, and his grandmother overheard him, and she turned on him and said, "How can you say that?" So he thought, uh, "Now I'm really in trouble. I've upset my grandmother." But he explained to her what he meant, and she said, "Oh, I see your point." She accepted Islam. Was a Muslim for four years until she died, and her family made life miserable for her until she died. You never know. You never know. Don't you know? Be so sure. Uh, and there's people here who can probably tell you similar stories. Uh, uh, I just heard one the other day of somebody who no one would ever guess this would be the last person who'd ever turned to Islam that they did. That was one thing to keep in mind before you form judgments. You think you know what's in somebody's mind. The other point is that. If you're in your family's home, you don't have to cover yourself anyway. So uh, I have to know exactly what are the circumstances. I mean, is it a matter of you leave their home and they follow you down the street to see if you covered yourself or, or, or what? <laughs> yeah, but uh, does she know what, the, what, what goes on anyway? <laughs> Why the woman 
I hope so. <laughs> yeah, that there's a lot of mis uh, Oh, you know, that's that's a tiny piece of it, really. That's not the real. That's not the real background for that. That's a, it's supposed to be a mark of, a, uh, for one thing, a mark of dignity to a, a woman that says she doesn't have to advertise what she's uh, not selling. Uh, it has nothing to. Well, it has very little to do with the idea that men are such animals they have to be protected from looking at women. That that may be a part of it, but that's very little to do with it, really. That's because uh, <laughs> I don't think men are like that, but <laughs> that some may be. But that's not the point of it. Women are not covered to help men from out of their difficulties. Uh, it's uh, something that's supposed to do some good for the woman, and it may be an aid to the man, but the point is what it does for, for women. Uh, 